Their message is loud and clear. All efforts will focus on implementing a dignified and secure exit of the Prime Minister. Should the House of Senate expeditiously pass the retirement bill for royal assent, the Prime Minister may be ending his five decades long and illustrious political career by the end of this week. We feel that uh, if that is proceeded with as a matter of agency, we can be able to see the improvement in terms of political relations in the Kingdom of Lesotho. The issue of the rule of law, as the statement indicates as well, is of cardinal importance because it is very important that the rule of law must always be upheld, but more particularly the respect and the acceptance of the judgments of the highest courts of this country. The members of parliament seen at the precincts of parliament following the high court ruling that ordered an immediate ending of prorogation to parliament. The official opposition in parliament say Tabane's military deployment must be condemned. We understood that he was actually sending the army to his political enemies per se because he had just lost the court case whereby he had a, a prorogued parliament. Then we thought he was not happy as a result uh, of being forced by the courts to open parliament and let the processes of parliament to kick start. Among them was uh, actually a bill which curtails the powers of the prime minister for dissolving parliament if he loses vote of no confidence. So we thought he never liked such a bill. He personalized it to mean a removal of him as a person. The Minister of Health says there has been arrests in regards to the stolen Alibaba Foundation donations. The problem came at the destination where this was supposed to be, to be received. That's where the distribution uh, got confused and got missing. There are arrests already because when I get to Ndadekhatebe, Ndadekhatebe will give a need to another. So there is a chain. We are just giving police chance to round up and then we'll come to discuss in details once that is done. Meanwhile, as the world focuses on the efforts in fighting COVID-19, the Minister of Police was seen allegedly loading boxes of alcohol in contravention to the COVID-19 regulations. His police subordinates nabbed him and slapped him with several charges. He was later released on bail. Rapelang Khatebe, SBC News, Maserolus.